The Nigeria Customs Service Lagos Free Trade Zone Command celebrates a record-breaking revenue of 54 billion naira in the first quarter of 2024. The outgoing Customs Area Controller, Controller Mohamed Babamdede, in a ceremony reeled out the command's remarkable achievements while handing over leadership to Controller Olarinwaju Olumo. Speaking about his experience at the command, Controller Babandede noted that the most important thing he's taking out of the command is the synergy between agencies and engagement with stakeholders. When I came in September, the free zone were able to only generate a revenue, a, a revenue of about 2 billion, 3 billion. To God be the glory, we can now generate 15, 25 in a month. And uh, you know, we engage a lot of stakeholders, we work with agencies because we cannot do it alone. We work with other agencies, so we establish a bond, like a family bond. On his part, the new customs area controller, controller Olarinwaju Olumo, appreciated his predecessor for his purpose-driven leadership, pledging to build on his very good foundation while also soliciting support from stakeholders and officers. I am happy that I'm not meeting this command at the scratch level. I have an opportunity to build on the very good foundation country of Abandidi is leaving behind. I thank you, controller, for your purpose-driven leadership. To our critical stakeholders, I must acknowledge the wonderful support you have been giving the command over the years. I want to assure this esteemed audience that the overriding goal will be how to make this command more robust, more alive, and more economically rewarding to the country. I assure you I'm going to have a very open door policy, just like my brother did. Stakeholders as well as representatives of sister agencies showered encomium on the outgoing CAC while also urging the new CAC to continue on the integrity and legacy already in existence. My expectation from the new controller is to, be, is to double uh, his effort. So I don't know uh, the capacity at which he will be working, but I expect much more from him so that the integrity and the legacy that Babandede had left will continue in the, in the free zone. As Controller Babandede passes on the baton to Controller Olumo, he leaves behind a legacy of accomplishment and sets the stage for continued growth and prosperity within the Lagos Free Trade Zone. Lucy Nyambi, NCBN News, Lagos.